Good morning, YouTube. This is Anna Fish here, and welcome to more Pokemon Stadium. Third trainer at the Fuchsia City Gym. Um, so these are like all psychic types. So much for freaking Poison Gym. Um. Well, Articuno, Moltres, and let's go for Pidgeot. All flying types. If these things have electric moves, I my butt is kicked. I really should have picked like Snorlax or something not so bird or flying types. Whatever. This should work pretty well. This whole game is like one big ice beam spam because I think ice is just really powerful against most things. I'm gonna use this for like Sabrina and like, and I'm saying and like a lot. I'm just gonna use this for yeah, Sabrina, Koga, whatever other trainers that I don't exactly have good super effective against. Is this going to be hit with like Articuno's ice beam? This thing has metronome, that's slightly unfair. Alright. Hmm. I'm recording without Mr. Zoom again. Sometimes I don't forget to introduce him. I'm probably gonna do this gym. I wanna have someone to co-commentate Sabrina with me, because that gym is probably gonna piss me off, but judging by how the gym trainers have not actually had the type they're supposed to, it's just the gym leader. I'm thinking having a team of just generally good Pokemon like I usually do is probably gonna work in my favor. Ice Beam. Um, sky attack. Yeah, so it's sky attacking me, and then I'm sky attacking it, I think. All I know is that it's mimicking me. What? I thought when it was doing the charge thing last round, I forget what mimic does, so I thought it was like something like mirror move, but I guess it doesn't. Phoenix. It's a phoenix, okay. Harry Potter. They're almost always. Oh, the sheer stupidity of this is just hilarious to me. I wonder if there are any ghost types in this game that have actual ghost type attacks. Alright, Mr. Zoom's favorite one sided battle. What? Good. What? I've never encountered a substitute spammer before. I guess I sorry I kinda wasn't talking there, but Oh my god. Substitute spamming? Are you serious? Oh, are you freaking serious? Oh my god. You're just gonna kill yourself. You're making me waste precious spam in ice beams. Is this revenge for the fact I'm an ice beam spammer? I come across an equally annoying and unusual kind of spammer. Oh my god. Next round, you should just create a substitute that kills him. Good. Sparks flying, I mean, spams flying. What? No, 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 you, no, you're not. You can't do that, no. Because now you're going to make more freaking substitutes. No, 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 you are not doing that. No, no, Ugh! 
Now I'm getting really mad, but this game seems to love me, so I'm sure I'll find a way out of it. It's just being a freaking substitute spirit. Critical, yes! Good, you're dead, and you deserve it, you butt munch. Ugh. I'm not actually that agitated, I just thought that would be funny. And I bet like a million of internetses are just gonna think that that I'm only saying that because I don't want them to find out that really this game agitates me when it doesn't. All right, so leader and looks like my game audio just cut out. I'm surprised I didn't do that during my last recording session because normally it does. And I don't know why. It's just a problem with my emulator that I play a lot of games on because I don't have a capture card, as you've seen from my console games. It's just like a webcam or a video camera or something held up to the TV and a bunch of guys with wireless controllers. But, um, enough time wasting. Uh, I'm thinking Articuno, Chansey, Slowbro, Slowpoke. Um, that's a good team to take on this gym leader, right? I'm counting on Articuno just pretty much destroying everything, and wheezing is a physical wall, wall, right? Please, please be a physical wall. Please have horrible special, please. Don't be a special tank. Don't be a special tank. I don't think it's a special tank. Yeah, Thunderbolt, you know what, that's, I think that's acceptable for a wheezing to have. I don't think that's too bad, and if any of my old friends who used to play Pokemon stuff watch this, they're probably going to find it funny, because they'd understand all these attacks, and just, I don't know, I just think that my little freak out back there, would they'd find that humorous. Plus, I think Philip should also, or, oops, I mentioned him, but I think my friend should also see this, because it is spo supposedly a gym of ninjas, and he knows it, and he watches my videos, so... Even my Pokemon ones, which like no one wants, to, no one was like saying enough, but Mr. Zoom to co-commentate one of my Pokemon Let's Plays, because like all my other friends won't co or guest commentate in like my Pokemon Blue or anything, because they just are like, oh my god, it's a Pokemon game, that's for nerds, and then they watch it anyway, and I'm like, thanks guys. Good. A failure, Venomoth. I don't even know how you outspend Articuno. Especially an Ice Beam spamming Articuno. Those are the best kind. Why is it not super effective? Alright, try doing something other than... Oh yeah, you did. And you're probably gonna do a little bit of damage, and then, like, crush yourself and recoil. Now, that's one thing that... Uh, that's, like, pretty much one of the only downers that your opponents don't crush themselves and recoil like they do in the original not original, but usual games, and I could be imagining that they crush themselves and recoil, and maybe it's just because all the Pokemon in this game are at level 50, or in some of the later things, like level 51, but I really cannot say for certain. And Sky Attack, yep, that is the command for Sky Attack, and I think that'll be pretty effective on Nidorino. So, blah. Uh, Thunderbolt. That is not acceptable, because you have, like, a later ground of evolution, and ground should not be able to learn thunder, but thunder should be able to learn ground, because Zapdos is an earthquake kick butt. Because you don't think a Zapdos would have an earthquake, and that is why it did kick butt. That was a horrible, like, voice thing. Oh, crap, I'm going down. Well, uh, well, nearing the end of a video, nearing the end of this battle, Articuno has done an amazing job throughout this entire game. And it will be well commended. Um, let's go with Chansey. The Pokemon I was thinking I would mainly use for this, other that wasn't an Articuno, I haven't actually used yet. But Chansey has a cool opening dance. Although I wish his opening dance was the Chansey dance, but it's not because that didn't exist. Okay, sorry. Um, Thunder. I think that'll be funny. Wait, is it ground yet? Oh, well, Chansey has a bazillion HP, so I'll be alright. Um, wow, that worked. I didn't... 
Wow, was not expecting that. I was not expecting that to go as smoothly as it has. Well, that's kind of cool. That is kind of cool. So, this has been a part of Pokemon Stadium. Or, yeah, because I'm ending this off pretty soon. But I'll get the key to Sabrina, and then I'll probably go after Sabrina with some kind of co-commentator. Or, not co-commentator, guest commentator. Because I don't want to have to deal with the stress of an annoying gym. So, um... Yes, I will be seeing you. This is Danny Fish, signing off.